Oh, we're back. We're back. Yeah. H Howie here from Howie's Late Night Rush. This is probably the highlight of my piddly half hour show. But this is really more exciting for me, if that's such a phrasing. Five years since he's been up here. Charles Fleischer, the man of a, can I say a thousand voices? I was trying to actually count them, and I got to like uh, 115. I would say uh, N plus one. Because whatever it is, whatever. you can always add another one just by well, just making it a little higher. Or a little lower. Or a little more southern. A little more New York. Or more eastern. A more western. High western, low western. You can always just tweak it. See, that, that, was, that was seven right there. The seven? Point. I counted 15. Right. What happened? Oh, the I don't know if you bump. like to fist bump, bump or a handshake. Because, you know, there's a lot, we have a lot of germaphobes out there, you know. So like this. Yeah. Charles, why is it taking so long to have you up here and you've been doing a zillion things? Well, I've been busy, you know. It's like I love coming up here, but um, oh. Uh, yeah, oh yeah, last night in my intro, uh, Zodiac. Did you see Zodiac? Yeah. See? Did you know I was in it? Mm-hmm. Okay, just checking. That's the best work I've ever yeah, done. Yeah, that was a, a, well, I reviewed that movie and I didn't know you were in it until I actually saw it. And I went, is that Charlie? I go, oh my gosh, it really is. Wow. Marilyn Manson told me that, he said, I know you, and you scared me. Marilyn Manson said that? To me. He said that he was scared by you? Yeah, he, he, I oh, know Manson. Funny. I opened for him on New Year's Eve. In, Marilyn Manson? Uh, in Vegas. Yeah. That must have been a trip. Uh, but yeah, he said he, he scared me. And also, just back to the movie, not to oh. go to Manson tangent, just to get a little more self flagellable cushion. If you've seen the film, there's a scene where Marvin Belli, the defense attorney, mm -hmm is on a uh, call-in television show where the, supposedly the Zodiac calls in. Turns right, out it's right. just a mental patient. And uh, Fincher had me do that character, too. Wow. So there's actually two characters in the movie. See? But I don't want to talk about me. I want to talk about you real quick. I want to uh, talk about... It's a one-man show. You're the only comic we've had up here who gets the whole, like, one hour and ten minutes. I come out and do my little ten... Please, I'm, but, I could know. get really emotional about that. I know, it's like a special. You know, we won't even talk about the fact that the other act had a serious accident. <laughs> I can't tell you what happened. Oh, unfortunately, there's no middle this time. Charlie's going to have to stretch. Is that a problem? I don't think so. Uh, yeah, they've uh, allowed me to do that because, uh, you know. It, it, it's a lot to condense, actually, into that time frame. It is? Yeah, it is. You know, in fact, and you do artwork, too. He has these incredible paintings. I described it as if you were to slice open your head and it's spilled out on the canvas, I think that would be the closest representation of I, your work. I don't know. Well, I have different kinds of work. Like you're, I got always, my... you're always drawing. Well, yeah, you got to. Let's I mean, see. but it's just, it's almost more than your writing. Look at this. This isn't good for the TV. You can't see that. I know, but look at that. It it's like... not even finished. It's just a sketch. But let me get to a more detailed one that'll freak people out. It looks out. like someone's internal organ. Hey, 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 come on, man. They don't talk about it in front of the girls. <laughs> How stupid is it showing my sketchbook on television? Isn't that wild, though? I just think it's great. It's like I have a need to, uh, to visually express myself. Hey, constantly, too. That, I love uh, can we add a tie shell? This is one of Mr. Flasher's recent sketches. Is that trippy or what, Megan? Look at that. that can we, can we get tighter on it? Yeah. Wow, that's just a... That's a good zoom. That's just a sampling. Well, that's like that's my sketchbook. Of you know. the mosaic mind... Mosaic? ...of Charles Fleischer. Mosaic. That's yeah, when, when one of the Three Stooges took Prozac. <laughs> It was Mo. Mozak, and then it became Mosaic, and then that became Muzak. Mo, Champ Howard. Which is? His daughter collects frogs. Wow. Folks, at the improv this week, frogs rare. Frogs the improv? Rare, well. Frogs? Check out Charles. Check off. Check off. Anton. Wow.